This evening's fourth race, open handicap pace of one mile, a purse of $9,000. Win place, exact pick three, wagering only. No trifecta, no show wagering here. Scratch the two, powerhouse Sabra sick. Scratch the five, my pal Mark sick. Presenting the field, the one is Eddie Rocket, owned by Sam Noble Jr. of Cedarville, Ohio. Trained by Sam Noble Jr. Dan Noble is up. The two, Powerhouse Sabra is out sick. The three is World Harvest, owned by the Jeff Miller Stable of Haviland, Ohio, and Dorothy Miller of Delphus, Ohio. Trained by Jeff Miller. Dallas Miller is up. The four is Brad's Gold, owned by the Darby's Edge Stable of Ohio, Joe Descala Jr. and C. Ed Mullinex of New York. Trained by Virgil Morgan Jr., Brett Miller at the lines. Number five, my pal Mark is out sick. And from the outside of the six, Capital Request, home of the Capital Acquired Stable of Frankfurt, Ohio. My Budweiser best bet of the night is trained by Dan Eater, Kyle Eater, and the Sulky. Being set on their way. They're off fan pacing and firing out middle of the track. There goes World Harvest. From the outside, there is Capital Request, who's driving out for the lead. Eddie Rocket comes away, racing in third. Dropping in, racing in fourth. That is Brad's Gold as they wheel by the opening eighth and over to the opening quarter they roll. And on top of the field, Capital Request is trying to clear to the front end tier. Along the inside, World Harvest will yield for a garden spot, racing in two. Eddie Rocket is racing in third. Brad's Gold racing in fourth. The opening panel in 26 and 3 fives as they pass the stands for the first time and head on down to the half and Capital Request leads the way here along the inside racing to his World Harvest but up on the outside here's Eddie Rocket to pressure the pace here as they step around the clubhouse turning on over to the half Eddie Rocket is trying to clear to the front Capital Request on the inside won't quite let him go but does so now Eddie Rocket onto the front end tier they reach the half they're halfway home in 56 seconds flat off the turn and driving down the back side of the open handicap and Eddie Rocket with the lead tier by two along the inside Capital Request is trying to go with him in second along the inside racing in third that is World Harvest fourth on the inside there that is Brad's Gold as they track down the back side on top Eddie Rocket with the lead tier for Dan Noble along the inside Capital Request is still right there in second reaching three quarters in 124 flat along the inside and now a move to the outside in third is World Harvest, and that brings as they turn to the top of the stretch, Capital Request out of the two-hole, to the top of Power Alley, less than an eighth of a mile to go, and down the stretch they come, Eddie Rocket to the inside, but he's under siege, and Capital Request blows right on by, Capital Request inside the final 16th, is getting up and drawing clear, Capital Request The unofficial front. winner of the fourth race, open handicap, the sixth Capital Request. Budweiser best bet of the night. Now the official winner of the six, Capital Request, is a five-year-old bay horse buying life sign out of an emotional mare. She buy no nukes. Home of the Capital Acquired Stable of Frankfurt, Ohio, trained by Dan Ader. Nicely handled here this evening by winning driver Kyle Ader. Well, the six, Capital Request, pacing home at 152, one theft for the second win in 2003. Capital Request and Kyle Ader, home a winner, 152, one theft. Six for exacta, six dollars even.